My name is Sophus Hell, and I am the author of In Hiduana, the complete poems of the world's first author, coming out with Yale University Press on March 28, 2023. And I am very excited to be releasing this book. It is a translation of the complete poems of In Hiduana, the first known author in the history of world literature. She was a Sumerian royal princess and high priestess in the city of Ur in what is now southern Iraq. And I'll be reading a short selection from her best-known poem, which is called The Exaltation of Inanna. The Exaltation of Inanna is a hymn to the goddess Inanna, the goddess of war, of sex, transformation, contradiction, change, and paradox. In this poem, Inhidwana has been exiled from her city of Ur and is wandering the wild, praying for help to Inanna. And the poem goes as follows. Queen of all powers, downpour of daylight, Good woman wrapped in frightful light, love by heaven and earth, holy woman of An. You hold the great gems, you love the good crown, to rule is your right, you have seized the seven powers of the gods. My queen, you are the guardian of the gods' great powers, you lift them up and grasp them in your hand, you take them in and clasp them to your breast. As if you were a basilisk, you pour poison upon the enemy, as if you were the storm god, grain bends before your roar. You are like a flash flood that gushes down the mountains. You are supreme in heaven and earth. You are Inanna. Your rage cannot be cooled, O great daughter of Nanna. Queen outstanding on earth, who can rob you of your rule? The mountain fell under your rule. Its harvest has failed, its city gates burn, its rivers run with blood. The thirsty must drink it. All its armies march before you, all its troops disband before you, all its soldiers stand before you. While the wind fills the squares where they danced, their best men are led before you in chains. Queen of queens, born from a holy womb to wield great power, you now surpass even your own mother. Wise and clever, queen of all lands, of living beings and the innumerable people, I will sing you a sacred song. Good goddess who is fated for power, it is daunting to sing of your might. Good woman, inscrutable and radiant, I will sing of your power. For you, I stepped into my holy home. I am in Hidwana, I am the high priestess. I carried the basket of offerings, I sang the hymns of joy. Now they bring me funeral gifts, am I no longer living? I went to the light but the light burned me. I went to the shadow, but it was shrouded in storms. My honey mouth is full of froth. My soothing words are turned to dust. Queen, beloved of heaven, may your heart have mercy on me. Nanna has said nothing, so he has said it is up to you. Let it be known, let them know that you are as mighty as the skies. Let them know that you are as great as the earth. Let them know that you deafen the enemy. Let them know that you grind skulls to dust. Let them know that you eat corpses like a lion. Let them know that your gaze is terrifying and that you lift your terrifying gaze. Let them know that your eyes flash and flicker. Let them know that you are headstrong and defiant. Let them know that you always stand triumphant. Nanna said nothing, so he has left it up to you. My queen, this made you even greater. This has made you the greatest. Queen, beloved of heaven, I will sing of your fury. I have piled up the coals. I have purified myself. The holy inn awaits you. Will your heart not have mercy on me?